A lot. 98 minutes played. Chelsea, three points, two goals to one. Winners here at the Tottenham Hotspur training facility. A good performance all round. It's been two brilliant pieces of, of football in excellence from Michael Golden and Josh Achiampong have given Chelsea the win this afternoon. Good performance all round, a good result. It's always nice to beat Tottenham, Clive. Certainly, this is what we wanted, isn't it, at the start of the game? You always say you take the win. But I think as well the nature of the win. I think we played well, the passing was good, the movement was good. There were periods, of course, where it was a bit scruffy and scrappy. That's to be expected, but listen, let's take nothing away from the two goals we scored. I think they were excellent. Michael Golden's finish and Achi Ampong's swing up from his left foot, top corner. Yeah, brilliant, lovely to see. Great, te great team to watch today. Absolutely right, yeah, well-contested London derby, a, a, a fractious event at, at times, but very much a, a composed professional performance from Chelsea. Harrison Murray can we can see in the centre of picture there, very much involved. Frankie Runham as well, Travis Akamir, the winning captain. Plenty of good displays, good performances. Teddy Curden, the Chelsea goal as well. Uh, and we'll see a lot of his involvement, actually, as we look at the highlights from this morning's and this afternoon's game. This one was an early one for Tudor Mendel Ado. Good opportunity here, Clive, and on another day you'd fancy him to finish that if you want for a really good tackle. Yeah, you, you've got to give defenders credit, to be honest, you know, because his pace just takes him away from from players and you can't catch him up, but they did on this occasion. Good save here by Kurt does well. Stands up on the near post, where you'd expect him to be, but uh, still has to make the save. He was Frankie running a real thorn in the side of, of Tottenham in the first half down this left with Boniface on the overlap. We saw that number of occasions and Lewis Flower very nearly heading Chelsea in front. Yeah, that deserved more in some, some respects. Good flowing movement, sort of right to left, then the overlapping run, then the nice little slide rule pass and this little clip into the box. Unfortunately, Flowers can't get uh, Flower can't get on the end of that and, and steer it on target. But lovely play. This was a super turn. This is when he sh shows how good he can be on the ball. His composure to to pick up Mar out Michael Golden again relaxes, sees the target, finishes well. You know, excellent goal. Really, really good goal from Michael Golden. Yeah, it's a, like you mentioned, the build-up play there from Frankie Runham just to turn and spin, and then the finish as well. He uses almost three or four Spurs bodies as, as like a distraction just to curl it round and right to the top corner. Brilliant opener. Yeah, nothing better than a, than a winger making a fullback look silly, and, <laughs> and, and Frankie Runham really did that there. But not only that, created a goal, which is superb. You would be biased from that perspective, though, wouldn't you? Of course. <laughs> I've seen it a few times. <laughs> Again, Good defending Murray, here. Murray Campbell, yeah, did brilliantly here, didn't he? Yeah, two blocks. You know, look like we're stretched a little bit. Perfect opportunity. Perhaps doesn't make the best contact on the ball that he can, Lancashire. But you know what? We had to get bodies in behind the ball, and we did well. Yeah, a good save from, from Gunter in the Spurs goal as well, because that was one that we've seen loop in previously and very nearly went in. I think it was off Flower in the end, but could have been off a Spurs defender deflected on as well. Yeah, we talk about delivery as well. I mean, another good ball in by Frankie Runham. This was poor by us, giving the ball away much too cheaply. And here you see Spurs bombing forward, getting bodies in the box, trying to make things happen, which they did, and uh, they get their just rewards. Simple tapping. Yeah, good finish from, from Jamie Donnelly, but it's right on the brink of half time, the first half. Largely in control from Chelsea's perspective, so disappointed to go in all level, but second half started. You'd have to say Spurs started very well in the second half, but thankfully, um, as it was as it would eventually turn out, Chelsea was continuing the ascendancy. But we, we yeah, saw it didn't last long though, did it for no. Spurs? That's the only thing I would say. We would expect it, like, as we see here, but it actually didn't last long. Decent enough ball in there, good save. At the near post. There's good pace on this ball, and they got a runner in there, and it turns into a, an excellent ball. But again, Sadi Kerr just sees it, smothers it. Good save, good distribution. Here as well, again, we saw down this left hand side the first half from Chelsea's perspective, and Spurs trying to work it uh, in the second half. Uh, a chance here falling for, for Mikey Moore to get the shot, but again, Harrison Murray Campbell in the way. Yeah, and we've seen that time and time again in the game, haven't we? Defenders getting their bodies on the line and, and getting some blocks in. Just thought perhaps he could have struck it a little bit quicker. Just There's a little bit of stutter just before he took the actual shot, which gave us chance to make the block. This was a good chance as well. Great first touch. On target, another day they fly in the top corner, but difficult one to take, but a snapshot that maybe could have caused us problems. But as we said during the game, 
Kurt sometimes makes things look so simple, doesn't he? Good hands. Really good save, and then Chelsea started to build, and you can see here from McMahon's delivery, very nearly Tudor Mendel who nodded Chelsea in front. Yeah, on another day that creeps in, doesn't it? You know, he doesn't get enough on it, or he gets more on it, and, it, and it's a, into one of the bottom corners, but decent delivery, McMahon does well, and his work rate today has been excellent. And again, this is the... Uh, goal from any fullback that goes forward will say I've done that in my career before <laughs> and Ati Ampong certainly does it well absolute sweetest strike you like he doesn't try to overhit it good space for him to do it the complaints from the Spurs coaches will be why didn't we close it down if you're given that space take the shot on and and get your reward and that's what he's done Absolutely right, and you've got to say if you're gonna if you're gonna win a game against Tottenham, to win it in the right way and win it with a goal like that is is very fitting because it was a fantastic finish and, and Chelsea very nearly had a little bit of a comfort blanket with Tudor Mendel Doe's header here. Mendel Doe, just for me, the ball hits him rather than he heads the ball. And I think if he had a done, I think it would have been a great goal. Really would have been. It's been a, an impressive performance from Chelsea and thankfully nothing else doing. So Chelsea win two goals. To one, Michael Golden and Josh Achiampong. Chelsea beats Spurs. What a good start to the weekend.